Welcome back to my space on the internet. It is your girl, isn't it? I am an Abuja YouTube based right here in the capital city of Nigeria. If this is your first time stopping by this YouTube channel, you are definitely welcome. So today, you guys, I'm coming coming on with you with something that is strange, okay? Because I know it is actually strange. I've tried to make my research about this particular thing, about this particular fruit and its seeds and everything, and it's just been crazy, okay, you guys. People don't really know it. People don't really know it. And as a result of that, they don't appreciate it. It is called the jackfruit. Okay, you guys. If you know about it, if you've heard about it, if you've tasted it, whether the fruit or the seed, let me know in the comment section below. Okay, you guys. Let me tell you. When I was growing up, ever since I've always been a child, whenever I go to my father's village, okay, my paternal home, I always see this particular tree that is big and short, okay, that is in front of the compound, literally at the entrance of the compound. And I'm always like, what is this thing? And people will say they don't know. I'm like, ha! Kekonon Kebu, you don't know. But this thing is here, and it's a fruit. And because growing up, I was that kind of kid who, whenever I would go home for Christmas, I would assemble every other children that came back for Christmas. And then we would start going from compound to compound, climbing trees, throwing stones, using sticks to pluck out, okay, fruit. Sometimes we end up getting, you know, using this buckle bag, it will be literally filled with fruit, okay, and we'll take it home. So I was actually curious every time I saw this particular tree because I did see this thing every time. Nobody they really touch her. Me said this thing they fear me because you guys, if you see how big these seeds are and hanging from the tree, my goodness. I just said, you know what, this thing that everybody has been running away from. So I'm tell you, you know that thing is demonic, nobody planted it, it just suddenly grew from there. And they didn't plant it, the thing just suddenly you know sprouted out from the ground and became that big massive tree with that short tree with the massive um this thing initially my people used to think it was a sycamore tree and i said okay you know what this time around i've traveled to the village let me even google this thing and find out what it is so i took a picture used the picture to search on google lens and you guys i found out that it was called jackfruit and it has it holds a lot of amazing benefits you guys it holds a lot of amazing freaking benefit like i was short i'm going to just leave them on the screen okay using text because <laughs> i can never stand them off of my head like i was screaming and saying what this is what we've been missing here this is what god created and gave to us that could cure a lot of diseases illnesses that could boost the immune system and do all these amazing things i decided to you know make further research and i discovered that this fruit was not just good the seeds were good the back of the tree was good and can be used for a lot of things even as tea the leaves can also be used to treat a lot of things you can make them as tea just the way you make lemongrass tea or your black tea and i said no 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 you know what i'm gonna deseed this particular fruit so i picked the ones that had fallen down and i deseeded them okay and then i came back to abuja with it but a few days ago some people sent the seeds to me and let me tell you guys guess what as soon as i found out okay or i made all those discoveries about this fruit I told some of the people that were around me, I roasted the seeds. The seeds can also be boiled, okay? Some can also be eaten raw. This is what it looks like, you guys. See it? Let me show you guys. This is the one that was sent to me a few days ago because people now were now going to pluck the tree, you know, when they discovered everything that I said, okay? After I shared my research with them, they literally, the seeds spread like wildfire in the village and people have been going to pluck. So my siblings quickly decided about two two i think two fruits this came out from two fruits and sent to me this is the remnant of the one i came back with like you guys it was a lot so what i want to do is i want to roast some of them and boil some of them okay you guys whenever when you boil it it's actually hard when you boil it or roast it it always tastes like ukwa you know this ukwa breadfruit okay yes it also comes off as you know coco yam if you've eaten a day this cocoa yam when they eat with the red oil yes it also tastes like cocoa yam just like yam when you roast it it's like when you're eating roasted yam you guys you guys you guys you guys so i'm going to roast it in the village when i roasted it okay for people and i told them what it could do and why they should not neglect it because they always just let the thing to fall and get rotten animals would pass and eat it and that was all nobody was touching it because they thought it was demonic or scary since they don't they didn't know where it came from I roasted it, you know, in firewood where they were cooking. You know, if you've been to the village, all of us have been to the village, you know what I'm talking about. I roasted it there and they ate it and they loved it. It was also boiled and some people loved it as well. So now in my house, I don't have 
I don't have firewood. I don't even have charcoal. What I have is gas and I'm going to be using it, okay? I already made the research on how to do that. So I want to share with you how you can eat this thing, okay? If you know me and you have my phone number, you can quickly send me a message to bring some few seats for you so that I can check them out, okay? I, I don't mind. I don't mind. Only that you pay my transport fare and I'm going to come, okay? <laughs> Please, before I finish this, though, because, hmm. So you guys, let us go over to roasting this thing immediately. Okay, do you want to do like, just say that. Do you? 